This is exciting. We have so many new project products to show you from We Are Memory Keepers, brought to you by American Crafts. This is Chris. Hi, Hi. Chris. Hi, my name is Carissa. And we have, I don't know, eight or nine different things that we want to show you. They're all very exciting, so please hold on till the end of the video so that you don't miss a single thing. Hi everyone, I'm excited to be here at Notions today showing these new products by We Are Memory Keepers. Um, most of these tools will be launching in August and September, so all just right around the corner. I'll be touching base on the foil quill, the new foil quill pens, how those can be used in conjunction with the foil quill magnetic board. I'll also be touching base on our new stamping daubers that can be used with ink pads or different inks. Our new glitter mini vac, which is going to be a lifesaver for those of us that love glitter. Our new Cropodile Multi-Punch, especially the All in Works One Tool. This is going to be a great tool for those of us that love to do a ton of different crafting components. Um, this puts all of it in one nice board. And then additionally, the Revolution, which is a, a new version of the Evolution tool with a better price point. All right, you're going to love it. Stay tuned. All right, I wanted to start off by talking about our Ginger Snap um, from the Homemade with Love brand. The Ginger Snap is a plastic version of a gingerbread house. So we can use this to decorate for any holiday season rather than just waiting for Christmas time to come around. This snaps together in six easy snaps. You can see on the back of the packaging here, the sides of the house and the, the roof all come separate. You just snap those together and decorate as normal. Price point on this is great at $14.99 same price point as one that is you know disposable so this is great you can use this year after year when you're done with the holiday season just go ahead and disassemble and wash off we recommend hand washing only and it can be put away for next year all right moving on we also have a stamping dauber kit stamping daubers are great they're a great way to blend when you're stamping there are 20 round daubers perfect for you know shading and blending things really nice and smooth and then the triangular daubers are great for hard edges there's also a dauber bottle. This slides right off and it has a spring release tip. You can just put whatever paint or you know medium that you want right in here and then that tip will just release it. All right, moving on, I'm gonna touch base on this Cropodile Multi-Punch. The Cropodile is a great tool from We Are Memory Keepers. It's really strong. Um, most of our Cropodiles feature a two size a two size shift. This is great. It has five different sizes and that work on a swivel system. So you can just rotate through whatever size punch you want from 5 16 all the way down to 1 16. So you got a nice large hole punch there. It just swivels and then you can do a nice slow punch. There's also these alignment guides on the end. So if you only want to cut into your paper one inch, three quarter inch, half inch, you can kind of check that way to make sure that you're going the same depth each time. This is a really exciting tool from We Are Memory Keepers. This is the Glitter Vac. So glitter is so fun to work with, but we all know it is a mess to clean up. It's hard, it gets everywhere, and it's hard to clean. So this is great. It works on any surface, and um, a hard surface is best. It has these great little roller brushes on the bottom that really help pick up the glitter. Just turn it on and watch it do its magic. This is awesome because it is powered by USB, so once you're done, you want to replug. You just charge it right up to a USB port. Speaking of which, the We Are Memory Keepers Power Bank is a great tool to have. Tons of our new tools feature this wonderful um, power bank so that you can charge your tools that way. We are, because it's a nice, really good clean. You can just keep going until it is smooth. To show you how easy it is, you just twist the top off. There's all our glitter. We can throw that right in the garbage can. All right, up next we have the cordless airbrush marker from We Are Memory Keepers. This is a great kit. It comes with the airbrush marker, a set of markers, and also some stencils to get you started. You can use the stencils or you can freehand. The great thing about this program is the markers that it comes with. These are really the best markers to use for this because of the exposed nib that they have that sticks out much further than any regular marker. You just simply insert it right into the airbrush. I have the airbrush plugged into my power source. And then we just go. This is great because it creates a nice airy feel different than what you could get from stamping or any other type of application. 
Another great thing about this is once you're done, you just pull it out and it doesn't leave any residue. It's already shot all that ink onto the paper. So you're not gonna be stuck with cleaning this out. It's already good to go for your next color. So I'm just gonna switch out to a red and go again. So this is great to use the stencil or freehand and you can really just switch between colors quickly and easily to get a nice blended effect. All right, I'll show you this and you can see how you could easily keep switching between colors and going. Gorgeous way that it, it just sprays the ink right on there. It's very light, very nice. All right, another great thing to note about the cordless airbrush marker is once you've had it all charged up, once you've used the power bank, you can use it as is. We've got this nice and charged, and so now we can use it once again with a stencil or freehand. So you don't have to worry about the cord getting in your way. If you've got it all charged up and you planned ahead, this will work great on its own. These markers are really great. They're a nice water-based ink, so they won't leave a permanent mess anywhere. Very nice to clean up and easy to go. All right, up next, I have the new Revolution from We Are Memory Keepers. A Revolution is a new take on the original Evolution machine. The Evolution machine was a little different in that it had an adjustable roller system, so you could switch between different depths of products. You could use chipboard or paper or anything like that. What we found out is most people are using this for paper, so we were able to redesign this machine with paper in mind and get the price point down. So this retails for $99.99, which is a great which is a great reduction on the original price. It comes with all the important factors that the first machine had, which is a magnetic base to easily adhere your projects to, and then two different mat systems. We have a nice thick mat, perfect for cutting dies, or a nice thin mat, great for embossing. I'll show you how we use the embossing folder. I put the mat down on the magnetic base. I've got a piece of paper here, six inches wide. That's the depth, that's the width that this will work with. Okay, got my folder. I'm gonna add the embossing mat right on top. And then we run it through the machine. I always recommend running it through one way and then back through the other way just to ensure we have a nice thick emboss on that. Additionally, this is our prototype, so the real machine will be in the classic We Are Memory Keepers mint color and white. There's a beautiful embossed. All right, the next program I'd like to show you is the Foil Quill program from We Are Memory Keepers. The Foil Quill program is an awesome program that allows you to foil with your electronic cutting machines. So we've taken it a step further. For those of us that don't have an electronic cutting machine but still want the ease of foiling, we've now made these freestyle pens. The freestyle pens come in an all-in-one kit which includes a standard, fine, and bold tip pen. You can also buy all of those sold separately. Also, additionally sold separately, is the calligraphy tip. You can use this with the foil that comes already on the rolls. You can buy, um, we have a, a 4x6 pack or a 12x12 12 12 pack of foil, so that's really your preference. Here is one of the pens that we have ready to use. This is the standard tip. I have it plugged in again to my We Are Memory Keepers power bank. I'm also going to show how to use this in conjunction with our new We Are Memory Keepers magnetic mat. So here is our magnetic mat, and these are my magnets. This just really helps to keep the foil nice and tight against, against our project. So here's a piece of paper I'm going to use. All right, this is a sheet of the four by six foil pre-cut. You can also cut your own foil. Just like to slide it across to make sure I get a nice even work surface. Here we are. This just helps to keep everything nice and flat while we're working. All right. So now we freestyle. You can use this with a stencil, you can trace things, or you can just write. As you're writing, you can see it working. You can see the heat imprinting the foil into the project. You always work with foil side up and use a nice even pressure when writing. All right. Quick reveal to see the magic that that foil left behind on this nice black cardstock. 
beautiful way to hand letter and make it foiled all at once. All right, last but not least is the new works tool from We Are Memory Keepers. The works tool is great. It combines over a dozen of We Are Memory Keepers top selling tools into one nice compact unit. This is great because some people, they don't have a lot of space to store multiple tools or they like to take their tools on the go. This is a great way to save space and use a lot of great tools all at once. The base of this board features the trim and scoreboard. So you turn it this way, pop the arm out, and now you can cut paper up to 14 inches. You can flip this, flip this over. This gives you a nice straight edge so you can use the scoring. You can butt your paper right up to that nice flat edge. This flat edge is also nice if you'd like to use the precision press capability of this machine, which is right here. This is a precision platform. You put your stamps on this grid. It magnetizes right there. You can line your paper up and stamp just like that. If you want to make sure that you're holding your paper in place while you're stamping, I have magnets on the back of this board so you can easily place your paper up against that flat surface, hold it down with a magnet so it doesn't move, and then stamp that way. All right. Additionally, this is great because it takes some of our most popular punch boards and you can use them right here on this board. I'll turn this over and show you. This is where this stores, this guide. It just slides right out. Great compact storage. So we can make an envelope, we can make a tag, and we can make a banner using this guide. You will follow the alignment guides right here. If you're going to make a tag, you'll line it up right there. Also going to move it over to the two inch mark if we're going to make an envelope. And if we're going to use a banner, we rotate it like this and line it up on the four inch mark. I can show you how we go through each of those processes really quickly. First, I'm going to decide what size of banner I'd like to make. You follow the chart right here on the, on the guide. So if I want to make a 3x3 three three banner, I need to cut my paper to 3x3. Three three. Alright, I'm going to take this, I'm going to line the banner up, and I go to my guide here and it tells me that my alignment guide is 1 and 3 eighths. Right, so one and three eighths on that far end. And I cut, move that, and I just do a flip. Flip that paper right over, and you're gonna align again so that the point is right on the cut line. That way, you have a nice clean point for your banner. Then we can come up here, there's an alignment guide. This shows you the angles of your banner. You're just gonna align the left side up with the left line and punch, and then the right side up, and punch. Then you have two evenly spaced holes to loop twine or ribbon through. Repeat this and you have a nice banner. All right, also we can make an envelope. You follow the guide here and it shows you if you have an envelope, or if you have a card, excuse me, this is the size paper you'll have and this is the size card envelope you'll need to make to go with it. Once you're done, you will score all of your lines. We have an envelope notcher here and then a corner rounder on the other side so you can finish off the project. Last but not least, we can make a, a tab. So I'll show you how we do that. I wanna use a tab on a four inch piece of paper. I'll just start with a nice four inch piece. All right, which we'll do a four by six. As you can see right here, there's different numbers, four, five, six, seven. This is where you wanna use if you're gonna make a, a banner right, or excuse me, a tab right in the middle. So I'm going to make a medium six inch. So I go to the six, I line it up with the M for medium, and I punch. I flip it over, I line up in the exact same spot. Six M for medium. And there we have the notches. Bring it over to your trim and scoreboard. Line those notches right up so they sit on the cut line. Cut. Move that, we can flip it over and cut the other side. And there we have it. We have a tab right in the middle. If you don't want it in the middle, if you'd like it on the side, you don't need to worry about these alignment guides. You can just follow the alignment guides here. Small, medium, large. If I want a large, I align the edge of the paper up to the large. I cut my notch and I cut off the excess.
And there we have it. We can finish this off by rounding the corners. So this is the tool, the works tool from We Are Memory Keepers. Tons of components. We have this bone folder that sits right in the edge there. You can use this to create all of your envelopes. We also have these tools right here. You can put in the notches down here to make bows, tassels, pom-poms. This really is the works all-in-one tool. So with the We Are Memory Keeper works tool, I was counting, I counted 14. She said more than 12. I counted 14 at right. least different things you can do with this one. Right. On top of that, we just showed you nine new items coming from We Are Memory Keepers and American Crafts. There is so much going on. The products that we showed you will be coming out in August and September yep, over the next two months. of 2019. Yep. So contact your sales rep. You want to head into the store. If you're seeing this and you're thinking you need to have some of these tools, and who doesn't need to have some of these <laughs> we tools? We all do. <laughs> you got to head into your retailer. Tell them to get it on order now so that you're sure to get yours as soon as possible.